Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. So this vlog is all about Oxalis triangularis or butterfly plant. What's so special about this plant and why is it called the butterfly plant? Well, nakakatuwa tong halaman na to. Kasi aside from the interesting color which pops up in the midst of your pain green indoor plants and its beautiful flowers, every time na dumidilim, nagko-close or nagpo-fold yung leaves and flowers niya. And pagliwanag sa umaga, nag-open naman yung kanyang leaves and flowers to greet you good morning. So the whole day, maliwanag, naka-open ng leaves niya and will fall again sa takip silim. So, interesting, right? So, I'm hoping also to get a chance to capture the closing and opening of its sleep through time lapse. So, sana maharap ko soon so I can share it with you guys. So, what is the best way to propagate these plants is through its bulb. So, that's what I'll share with you guys today. I'll share my bulb propagation through loam soil versus soilless medium. Uh, let's see which one is more successful and saan mas faster magpropagate. I have also my water propagation and um, division. So, I'll share those uh, with you guys. Please stay and watch the full video. Hi everyone! We are back in my propagation area. And here is my oxalis. So as you can see, this one malaguna. Dalaki na rin ng kanyang dahon. Dami nga na rin flowers. But this one badly needs a repotting. Tingnan nyo yung pot niya, si Luma na. And then, look at this. Tumubo lang siya dun sa gilid. And then, ayan o, sayang kasi yung mga patubo niya para mailipat ko na rin. And then you can see, there's the bulb. The orange one. Lumalabas na yung bulb niya. Ang babaw nung tinubuan niya kasi. So, ililipat ko na siya ng pot kasi I wanna put it inside the house na rin. And then, I'm going to show you how to propagate this um, bulb. Yan, ang project natin ngayon. And here are my propagation through bulb. 2-3 weeks na itong mga to. So, yung ibang bulb na hindi pa tumutubo. So, this is my green. Ayan. Ito. Nag-iisa. <laughs> this is purple. Purple, purple. Ayan. This is another green. So, hindi sabay-sabay tumutubo. But, ito, Actually, madami na ito. Lakas ng hangin. Nagputol-putol. Hindi ko agad na ibabaan. So, kainis. Manipis lang yung tangkay nito eh. Kaya, pag malakas yung hangin, konting ingat pag nasa labas kasi madali siya mabali. Ayan. So, nilagyan ko ng tangkay itong isa. At lumulundoy pa rin. Nagligat na siya. So, let's go. Okay. So, let's start. Kita nyo kung gano'n ka nipis yung ugat niya. This one natanggal. We will try this one sa water. So this one is the bulb. So mag-iwan lang tayo sa kanya ng bulb. And then this area, this, uh, we are going to cut this. Uh, and then itatanim natin. So malaki-laki natin. Yan. This one, we're going to try it so water. You can also propagate oxalis in water. So, we put it inside the house. 
But for me, I just put it in my propagation area. So yung maglulose dito, let's do that. Propagate it sa water. So here's the bulb. What we're going to, I'm going to do is cut it here. Yeah. So here's the bulb. Let's cut it here. Yeah. So nakikita nyo to. So then, we are going to propagate this. Ito, let's divide this into two. Like this one, ah. Tanggal. Itong tangkay na to, let's put it sa water. Manipis lang kala sa lulutong at lulutong. sa may recycled um, loam soil. Pinagtaniman ko ng kamatis. So, alam niyo naman ang gulay, may life span. I'll use it. I'll use this. Malalang ito pa ito ng few days. Let it stay sa area without direct sun. This is our newly repotted. So we we'll let it recover. For the meantime, so attention. So for the meantime, this one, let it stay so water. Then let it go counting rooting solution. Let's wait for it to root. Okay. Dito na tayo sa ating propagation. This one is loam soil. Ang tagal niya nag propagate. Ang dalawa lang na buhay. So, no, so pa isa-isa. These are all from the bulb din. Dalawa. Tapos ang tagal mong antayin. Ito pang isa kong green. Hmm. Dalawa din lang. So, what I'm going to try, this one kasi, this, ito mga to, is true bulb propagation using loam soil. So, I'm going to experiment. Bumili kasi ako ng, I'm not promoting this brand, ha? This is not a paid post. But, I will try the soilless medium. So, this is best for seeds, the, ah, for seed rootings and cuttings. So, I'll try that one. So, I, I'll use this. Baka isa lang ka siya. I'll use this pot. And then, I'm going to observe how fast it, it is to propagate using the soilless medium. So, I'll show you what to do. So, this one is your sanitized laki, no? pang -teach. Sanitized cuchillo. And this one is the pop. So, what you're going to do Cut it lang in small pieces. Pwede nyo nga rin daw yan durugin eh. Buhay siya. So, this one.
Cut nyo lang siya. Small pieces. Like that. Ayan. So, ito yung ating itatanim. I'll use my I'll use this medium. Pababaw lang para hindi makasaya. Then, tan tanim lang siya. Hindi natin tanggalin tong ugat ng iba. Bawasan na natin to. Wala naman na pala. So, hopefully, let's see. Mas maraming tumubo. Hindi lang pa isa-isa, dalawang hipla. Yan. So, there we go. Tabuno lang natin. Yan. So then, that's it. This is our propagation through the bulb. Natin ng konting water, then ready na siya. Okay, so that's it. Hi guys, so just an update. Uh, hindi ako natuwa sa propagation ko ng bulb through loam soil. I just realized more than a month na sila and iilan lang yung nag-sprout. So what I did... Yes, I check yung condition ng bulb uh, dun sa mga hindi nag-sprout. I remove them. Uh, ilipat ko siya ngayon dito sa aking uh, soilless medium. Uh, I think propagating through this is really better. Kasi I have this uh, sample. Few days pa lang may nakikita na ako na sprout So, for me, that's a, that's a, a success. Kasi sa loam soil, ang tagal. Success rate is faster here. So, I, I'll try it for my oxalis also. So, this one yung unang batch natin from the, the one I got from the purple. So, this one is um, tinanggal ko dun sa ibang pinropagate ko through loam soil. So, let's see how fast it is to propagate through the soilless medium. This one, binabad ko na rin sa rooting hormone uh, for, for 24 hours. So, meron na rin ako nakita ng sprout dito eh. So, buhay pa naman sila. So, I'll use this one. So, this one is from... Ay, nako, sayang. Mahal yan, mahal yan. So, this one is um, from our soil, soilless medium. So, what you're going to do, ilubog lang sila, huwag masyadong malalim. So, wala ba sa aking kamay ko? Ilubog lang natin. So, ilubog lang yun sa mababaw lang. And then, put another layer of, um, soilless mix para matabunan siya. So, nakita nyo? Ayan. Iwaiwalayin mo lang. And then, put another layer here sa so, top. Tabunan mo lang siya. And then, a little water. Okay, so that's it. Uh, I'm going to observe this one. Kung how fast sila mag-grow. And then, I'll give you an update. Okay, so that's it. This is our true division. Rooted na rin ito. And, 
may bulb po siyang naiwan. Gandara. So, this is true water. So, i-update ko kayo how long will it take for this one to grow roots and our soil propagation. Hindi pala soil. Soilless propagation through this video. So, let's see how fast it is as compared to my previous propagation through loam soil. So, I'll keep you updated guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something from me today. Bye!